You can all agree with me that this photo frame that you are seeing on the screen is so beautiful, so unique, and it's perfect for any kind of gifts. Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Damilola. If this is your first time of coming across my video, on this channel, I teach skills that you can monetize. I want to talk about how you can make money. If you find such content interesting, then consider subscribing. And also, don't forget to turn on your notification bell. So that whenever I post a new video, you will be the first person to know. So today we'll be learning or we'll just be looking at the features of how this beautiful tabletop plate photo frame was made. Yes. <laughs> As you can see, it's plate like and that is why the name plate comes in yes the shape describe uh, or the shape just give us the name and the method they use in making this uh, photo frame is sublimation method it's just a normal way of making mug yeah sublimation mug that is the way they make this is the same process although the machine is different yes because of the shape but it is the same process that they used and just imagine anything that you can put on your mug even and many more you can put on this plate too you are not limited to only pictures neither are you limited to only words like the one you're seeing on the screen you can see that it's combination of pictures some beautiful flower designs you can see that it also carries a name which is like a word so that means you can put anything literally on this type of frame just imagine anything and you can put it it can be like an art piece it can be um an happy birthday wish it can be a festive period wish yeah it's almost christmas now you can just decide to wish your loved one merry christmas and give this some and give them something like this they will appreciate it you can agree with me that this is perfect for any kind of gift yes perfect you can also design the back yeah you can also design the back you can um, decide to leave it in front yeah and this type of uh, photo frame is very nice for office maybe on top of your uh, office table or maybe on your dressing table or you just want to put it at the center of uh, your house on the table on your um, center table uh, in your house you know you can actually put it anywhere and it will sit perfectly well on that you don't need to be scared of those or it's going to spoil or anything as far as it is on that carrier yeah i'm going to be talking about the carrier later yeah you can clean it with just normal clothes and it will still continue to shine like this uh, you can agree with me that it's just the normal concepts that they use for the normal dish that we use at home the difference is just what they impute inside. You can see most of the plate that we use at home, they carry flowers. They have different designs inside. So it is just the same concepts that they use in creating this. They only change what is inside by putting pictures and making it like a photo frame. So it is it's just the same thing. I just see creativity in this. Yeah, it's just creativity. It means that if you can think outside the box, you should be able to create something like this. All right, so let's just talk about the stand. So the stand is just like the plate hanger 
For our normal plate at home, some of us we have something like this, the hanger that we just used to, you know, stock our plates. The hanger can be in form of wooden, like wooden hanger or iron hanger. So depending on the one that you want. Although the iron uh, own is more expensive than the wooden uh, hanger. Funny enough, I think I will love the wooden one more than the iron. <laughs> but when you're looking at the durability, uh, iron is more, you know, durable. But when you're looking at something fancy, well, personally, I think I just love the wooden one. Uh, the wooden one is about 2000 plus, while the uh, iron horn is as is like 5000 to 6000 euros you can see that it is very very expensive it's almost like times almost like times like times 3 of um, the high on i mean the price for the wooden one so you can get it in uh, yaba yes that's where i know and that's why i always call <laughs> yaba in lagos you can get it in yaba and if you are not in lagos you can get it where they even sell plates all those people that sell kitchen utensils you can get this type of hanger from them they sell you know it's just the normal hanger that we use at home so people that sells um people that sells um plates i mean kitchen utensils they also sell something like this or people that sells um photo frame material people that sell frame yeah all those normal frame that we use they also sell something like this so where can you get this done yes you can actually walk to anywhere that they do sublimation and you tell them that you want to do something like this if they can't do it they will direct you to somewhere else and that is where that and that is how i usually get my things done i'll just go to where it is related like where, like if i want to make frame now and I see where they are selling normal frame, not the uh, custom one. I will just go there, buy the frame, and ask, please, where can I get this frame done? People like that, they will have people that are doing it around them, or they have the contact of such people. You get it? So you go to where uh, uh, you can get help. Like, just walk to any printing shop. Or anywhere they do supply or anything just go there and show them that this is something I want to do they will definitely direct you to where you can get it done uh, they also do something like this in Yaba yeah you can get it done in Yaba they do it there so uh, and for this is about one five to two thousand era to get the sublimation done so let's just roughly calculate the price let's say you are getting uh, the frame for Let's say you are getting the wooden one for two five, you are getting the plates for like two thousand, so it's about four thousand five hundred naira. Let's say your transportation and everything is just like five thousand. Trust me, you can sell this with the frame and the hanger. You can sell it for like ten thousand naira to twelve thousand naira. So gaining like um five thousand to seven thousand, I think is something it's something yeah so i hope this video has been helpful and you've learned something <laughs> thank you for watching please don't forget to turn on your notification bell also please like this video and comment in the comment section below in case you have any question i'll see you in my next one bye